The Chicago White Sox hosting the Los Angeles Angels and the White Sox are minus 115 on the money line. The Angels are minus 105. The over under is nine runs. The Angels getting a run and a half are minus 200, meaning if you bet them that way and they win the game outright, you win. Or if they don't lose the game by two, you win. The White Sox laying a run and a half are plus 170, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win the game by two runs. Now, Suarez did not pitch against the White Sox last year or this year, and Velasquez did not pitch against the Angels last year. He was a member of the Padres, and this will be his first matchup against them this year. The Angels are on a six-game winning streak overall, and the White Sox are on a two-game losing streak overall. Head-to-head, -head, the Angels are on a three-game winning streak against the White Sox. The road team is on a three-game winning streak. The Angels are 7-3. and three. The team getting a run and a half is 8-2. and two. And the over is 5-5. Five and five. Now looking at these pitchers' ERAs, it's reasonable to think that this game is going to go over. I'm going to take the Angels with the money line. I'll take the White Sox with the runs. And I'm going to go over the 9. Let's see if the numbers are right. Let's see if the numbers are wrong.